Right, uh, in this video we are going to go through the process of doing stock taking in ERP Next. So to do stock taking, let me first go to home. So this is our home page. So we go to stock and then you scroll down. I go to stock reconciliation. And then you click on add stock reconciliation. And then here you click on purpose. So when we are doing our first stock take, we can click on opening stock. But in the long run, we'll be doing stock reconciliation. So that will be stock taking. So here we can set our warehouse that we are going to do to be doing stock take for. So we are going to be doing stock take for stores. So we can come down here. I enter the item that I want to do stock take for. 5 liter container. Uh, so currently the quantity that comes here is the quantity that is currently showing in my system. So maybe we count and we find our quantity is 99. So I enter 99 there. I click add draw to end an next item. Uh, let's say I want to count ammonia. So I click on ammonia. So currently it will be showing the quantity that is already there in the system. So I can put here maybe 45. Add draw. I enter another item. Uh, there is no item that starts with 4. Uh, let me say long oil. So there is 2.5. So we can also hide this so that the one who is counting cannot see the quantities but uh, for this one we are going to be showing the quantities so this one I put more so after I finish you click on save and then it comes to draft make sure you click on submit if you don't if you don't click on submit there let me not put on submit if I go back to the consideration you can see it's in draft so make sure you don't have anything that is in draft uh, so let me click back and click on submit to finalize this if I want to print, I can print as well. So on this stock sheet, we can also customize it, remove some columns that we don't want. So here you can see the current quantity that was there and the difference, uh, the difference quantity that we got after we did our stock take. Uh, and so this is the quantity that we put and this is the quantity that was there before and this is the difference in the difference amount in the difference amount is going to affect the stock adjustment account so that's it for doing stock reconciliation or stock take in erp next